Stack Secured Entrepreneurs. In this video, Mr. Warren is going to get into four things, just four things as to how it is you're truly going to move into secured entrepreneurship. We have to do this because we put out so many fires this past week. It was insane. And I'm not just talking new entrepreneurs who came on board. And I want to thank all of the new secured entrepreneurs who came on board in the month of July so far. I want to thank everyone who emails. Thank you. Please continue to do so on info at auroradayconsulting.com. I'm referring to OG secured entrepreneurs, secured entrepreneurs who know better. But you know, I got to go dipping my foot over here in this water, seeing what happens. Oh, that didn't turn out too well. So what do we do? Okay. There is a reason why you have to have a system that is assisting you make more money, keep it safe, live your luxury lifestyle. There is a reason why 1% of the people are having all of the financial success. Miss Aurora teaches that here in the secured entrepreneur movement. Okay. So we're going to get into the four things that will actually take you into secured entrepreneurship. So you can come out here and do all the things that you actually are trying to do, but you have to listen up. All right. Can we do it? Okay. So for those of you who do not know who I am, I am Miss Aurora Day. And I've helped hundreds of entrepreneurs just like you build six and seven figure tax free businesses. You heard it right. Stick around. And we all know that this is the secured entrepreneur movement. All right. Now secured entrepreneurs, Please like this video, share this video, comment below because it's about to be heated and juicy. Subscribe to the channel if you have not, because we are growing the movement in these last five months of this year. We're talking, Mr. Warren is about to turn into Rambo at, you hear what I say? Yeah. The first thing that Mr. Warren is going to get into as it relates to you truly becoming a secured entrepreneur is correctly setting up your legal business structures. Now we see how hard these paper mills go in their marketing efforts to not only gain your attention, but to acquire your investment in their products. Okay. But unfortunately their products are not helping you create the proper, properly structured legal entities is what I will say there. Okay. You are not being helped with that. Okay. We are constantly seeing entrepreneurs who are applying for EINs as single member entities, as sole proprietor. But here in the secured entrepreneur movement, we know that sole proprietorship is for the streets. <laughs> okay. We, we like to say sole proprietorship is trash because we do know that that is the truth, right? So your EIN is applied for incorrectly. You've got an operating agreement that is done incorrectly. It's got all types of jargon that have absolutely nothing to do with what it is your company is attempting to get accomplished. Okay. That is a problem. All right. Then most importantly, you are operating out of an incorrect legal structure. You are operating out of a single member limited liability company, and you are operating that single member limited liability company in the wrong state. You do not have any anonymity. You have not given yourself a fighting chance to come out here and operate properly in commerce, giving yourself the time to get your business straight. You've got your, you've got your personal information splattered all over the internet. Okay. Now what's happening? Now you've got people telling you 
how to come out here and get money. Now, we all know that when you first start this entity, the entity is not going to get the type of money that you may be in need of. So they're telling you that you're going to set this little entity up. You're going to be the guarantor and you're going to acquire this business credit, but it's not actually business credit. It is credit for you personally, because your personal social security number is going to be hooked all into that. The reporting is going to be on your personal credit report. Okay. And so a lot of you who come on board here at Aurora Day Consulting, you say, okay, I don't know what I'm going to do because now my personal credit is ruined because I've gone out there and I've acquired this, this uh, credit card. I actually did use it for marketing. I did use it to acquire things, but then I didn't really work the business. Now raise your hand very high. If you have done this, okay, there's no shame in that because what happens is some people get, you know, they, they, you know, they catch the fire, they get on fire about doing a thing, but then they don't really have all of the information. They really can't, there's no lift off. It's a, it's a failure to launch is what's really happening. Okay. So the very first thing that you're going to have to do to become a secured entrepreneur is assure that your legal entities are structured properly so that you are operating the correct way in commerce. You don't have a reason if you, if, first of all, if you need capital, all right, if you need capital, which a lot of people do, which is why you see that people move in groups, you see that people move in groups, right? Because the, together the group is going to come up with all of the finances required to make a business go grow and flow when you are doing this by yourself you have to now understand that you need time you need time so you cannot get hyped you cannot get hyped and then start going off and start going crazy and doing things that are just it's ruining you it's ruining you that's that's the fastest path to a bk <laughs> okay trust me I know been there, done that, got the silk blouse. Okay. That is the fastest path because you, you don't have the correct guidance. You don't have the correct mentorship. You're going to groups and stuff like that, because that's what people tell you to do. Oh, go to conferences, go to groups. It's a bunch of hype. It's a bunch of hype put on by people who are not even operating their businesses correctly. Why? Because they don't actually have a business. They are representing companies that they are selling products for. So many of you get caught in the trap. Now, now I talked about the LLC, but also when it comes to the structuring, you've got to have the system of the LLC and the trust, which is why we have the sole proprietor to CEO program where you're getting the two LLCs, because that's the other thing that people wake up to. Oh, Mr. Roy, now I understand why I needed two. I can't just operate out of one. I get it now. You're going to get the two LLCs and the private trust. Okay. Why? You have to create the wealth cycle. If you're serious about coming out here, making more money, keeping it safe and living your luxurious lifestyle, you've got to create the system that causes that to come into fruition. Okay. Hear what Mr. Aurora is saying. The next sole proprietor to CEO group session is on August the 1st. It is a Thor's day at 4 PM. Okay. You're going to get four weeks, one hour a week as the group with Miss Aurora. Okay. You're going to get your legal entities properly set up. We're going to do the full credit program so that you know how to do the credit properly. Hello. You're going to have 90 days consulting. Each person is going to have 90 days consulting with Mr. Roar. There's a whole lot more, uh, go down the, go down to the link under this description and, and click on that. And you can find out all about the next group session. 
make sure you are there. Okay. Because what's happening right now, we've got a lot of work going on in the Bahamas. How many of the secured entrepreneurs know that Bahamas is a key place for a lot of key players simply because there, there is no income tax, no capital gains tax, no inheritance tax. Okay. It's easy for you to get your residency. All right. Once you get your residency and you're out there operating your trust properly. Okay. Because remember you are separate from all of these entities. All right. You are managing these entities. We, we get into how this whole thing works in the sole proprietor CEO program. Once again, make sure you're there for August the 1st, but right now we've got a whole lot going on in the Bahamas simply because it's easy for us to navigate our wealth cycles, which, which brings me into the second thing I'm going to share as it relates to you truly being a secured entrepreneur is tax efficiency. You see operating in commerce properly the way that Miss Aurora is teaching the secured entrepreneurs is setting you up to optimize for tax efficiency. You see, you have got to master minimizing taxation. You have got to master how to utilize these legal entities to lessen your tax burden and maximize your wealth, which is why we are utilizing these entities and financial strategies in places that allow us to build life, build our families. Okay. Let me just say this quickly. First, let me ask you to like, like this video, share this video, subscribe to the channel, please comment below for the heat. <laughs> okay. Uh, understand that we are, we are within a corporation. Every United States citizen is a citizen of a corporation that wants you to pay attention to the corporation. It doesn't want you to pay attention to your family. It doesn't want you to pay attention to your own personal needs. It doesn't want you to pay attention to your well being. It doesn't want you to pay attention to your physical health. It doesn't want you to pay attention to your mental health. It is designed to keep you going and going and going the wrong way so that you're doing everything that the corporation needs for you to do. But what about what you need to do? What about the families that you created that you need to care for? You see, everything is taking every person so far away from that. Pay attention. Some years ago, I did a, a, a video or a blog talk with, uh, with Victoria. And we talked about how your family is your business. Okay. So see how it is that everything is designed to separate all of us from our families. This is not only a physical thing that's happening. It's also an energetic thing that is happening. Some would say is a spiritual thing that is happening, but it is extremely real. Okay. So you've got to now focus, focus and hone in on the fact that you are supposed to be creating this legacy the right way. You see how families run the world. Families run the world. Why, why is your family not being super? Why don't you have a super family? Why don't you have a mega family? We see a whole lot of families out here making it make, making big things happen and they're moving as one unit, but the average family can't seem to get along long enough to make that happen because somebody has to be poisoned. By, by, by certain things. That's all I'm going to say about that. That's all Mr. Roy is going to say about that because in dealing with a whole lot of secured entrepreneurs and hearing, you know, and myself personally going, we, we're all going through something. We're all having something that could be the largest distraction from what it is we're really supposed to be here doing. And all we want to do is do it the right way. All right. 
that leads me to the third thing that Mr. Rohr is going to put on this PB&J. You've got to now come into adopting the CEO mindset. You have got to have the CEO mindset. And what does that mean? Primarily, you have to focus on strategic growth. You've got to now do some strategic planning. You've got to now understand what's going to be going on for you and the business that you're operating long term. You've got to really hone in on the fact that you are truly the head of the household. You are truly the head of this business. You are truly the head of your own corporation. This is CEO you. <laughs> okay. Cause you have to be the CEO. You've got to develop a very sharp mindset. Begin to study CEOs that maybe you admire. Get into what it is that they did. Pick somebody. And then number four, I'm going to build in legacy wealth. And that means that you're going to be creating a legacy plan. And I'm talking a very comprehensive legacy plan that includes succession planning, estate planning, and wealth education for your heirs, your children, your grandchildren. Okay, you're going to create the playbook that is passed down to the heirs that you have only dreamt about. You won't physically be here to enjoy them, but you know that they're coming. You're leaving the playbook. This is not a joke. It's not a joke. People, I want you all to wake up and truly get real. Number one, get you have to get out of the illusion. You've got to get out of the fantasy of what you think is happening, about what you think is going on. Because I can tell you that that's not what it is. I can tell you that. And many of you already know it. So lastly, all Mr. Roar wants to ask you to do is make sure you are there. If you have not, if you are not a secured entrepreneur yet, and you know you need to be one, sign up for the Sole Proprietor CEO group session. Go down in the description box below and sign up for the group session, August the 1st. I promise you it's going to change your life forever as an entrepreneur. All right. That's what Mr. Aurora wants to share in this video. You all know you can find me, Mr. Aurora Day, at AuroraDayConsulting.com. And until next time, 